but personal level? Well, that is part of our conversation, but yesterday we also had the deputy president, that is Rigati Gashag, we're talking about the foreign exchange status of the country, and he made a remark in regards to CBK not having enough reserves. That's why uh, as oil importers were looking for these reserves. And we had a rebuttal from the Central Bank of Kenya around midnight saying, we don't deal with uh, oil importers, we deal with matters government alone. So this back and forth, it's, it's brought up a conversation about our understanding about foreign reserve and the impact of and the status to of our foreign reserve and we will be exploring that on our show today well tighten your seatbelt we're about to take off are you ready am i well i am we start with matter cbk where the central bank uh, has come out to calm the markets after deputy president regardi gashago disclosed that kenya's foreign reserves were not sufficient and thus causing a dollar shortage in the country the dp in a tv interview expressed concern that cbk had run short of dollars thus affecting all companies who are then uh, who are in need of business on matters importing petroleum products the cbk in a statement issued to newsrooms affirmed that kenya has enough forex reserves to cater for 4.5 months of import cover All right, now we want to cross over to the land where the head of state watches Chivumbi. Talk about Uganda. Uganda is lobbying for increased efforts to make doing business within the East African community 